aboard the nightingale. Renba left a crystal for Miari to find, but what was he trying to tell her? Press any key location. I am quite certain in my analysis, mistress. The crystal we found, mistress, and the element inside the brooch, they originate from a moon somewhere in the edge of the cyclones. Cyclones is a dangerous wild. There's nothing there but clouds and storms. I am aware of that, mistress. I wonder, what exactly did Runba discover? We'd better find out. Put out the sails, Six. It really is like a traditional seafaring vessel. It's all wood and and sails and such. Ah, the crystal moon. Found a purple crystal star left by Remba at the foot of the statue of the water goddess for Miari to find. I had traveled to the lush rice paradise of Mercy, but found nothing except for a strange crystal. I miss the place. The air is soft and scented. Blah. But if there's any reason to return, I would. No. We're going to the crystal moon. The chunk of crystal Remba left in Mercy came from this distant part of space. Blah, blah, blah. Don't know enough time. Okay. Let's plot a course. That looks good. That's actually the path that I intended to take. So let us sail. The Verdant Pass, sailing to the Crystal Moon. All right. Wonder if what happens if you get lost, but we'll keep up with it. Whoa, I thought I was supposed to go right. Wait, is it telling me either way is fine? That does not seem right. Are there other ships on the river, mistress? I've not seen any. There are other ships out there. But you rarely see them. Everyone goes at the same speed. So no one ever passes you by. Silk Pass. People who like people stay on the ground. Do you not like people, mistress? That explains a lot. That seems a little turbulent. Tell me, is there anything you do like? Ooh, this is rough. Thanks, all right, I suppose. I'd marry him to make Miari happy. But if I did that, I wouldn't stay on Iox. Is there a way for me to catch any drift? Here we go. Whoa! Now I know how to open my sails. Swish. Whoa! Whoa! This is a wild ride. Come on, stay in the middle of the path. Don't get diverted too much. Go straight he on here, mistress. I didn't like Iox on Mercy. I 
always thought the Iox treated other planets well. You think Iox treats planets other than Eldreth well, mistress? Oh, I didn't know who's talking. I wish they had different colors. Personally, I do not think that Iox considers Eldreth to be special at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Either way... Wait, is that the moon right there? Or something else? Hi! Ooh, that looks promising. It looks purpley up there. No one knows how far the rivers go. No one's ever mapped them. Not even the robots. Or if they did, they aren't telling. What are the rivers, Six? Flows of oxygen, hydrogen, ice. The velocity keeps them coherent. Oh, that's him He's talking. So why do the rivers wind? Why aren't they straight? I lack evidence, mistress. Why does water swirl when mixed with wine? Evidently, it is most mysterious. I do not know where I'm going at this point. I wish there was a way I could bring up the map. The path turns left ahead, mistress, should we? Mistress. Oh, no, no. Exactly how many robots have you lost? I missed that turn. Oh, reset. Backspace. Do I have to do that all over again? Or will it take me before this spot? They just keep giving me more. There we go. Got the right one this time. Weep. Have I been here before? This looks awfully familiar. Whoa, that looks promising. It's purple. The river leads to our dest- oh. Either of the rivers leads to our destination, mistress. Oh, this is interesting. Okay. I like how it goes on to a helix shape. If Massey really hates Iox and Ioxians, what was Renba doing there? Something must have led him there, or maybe they were helping him. Yeah, that one. Maybe he was helping them somehow. Vicinity of the Crystal Moon? Ah! Plotting a revolution, you mean. Evidently, it is implausible, certainly. I think the Crystal Moon is close at hand. There's a rock up ahead. What have we found? Above the crystal moon. Why would anyone come to a lonely spot like this? We've arrived, mistress. The moon below us is rich in purple and eye-like crystals, but... There is no surface flow. We cannot land the ship.
but Brenda must have gone down somehow. Indeed. Most likely he used a hopper. We might do the same. Hopper? The Nightingale is fitted with a hopper, of course, for instantaneous travel. Is it safe? Not really, mistress. No. This moon does not have any air. I will have to go down alone. If there's no air... How did Renba go down without a robot? It would have been impossible. But Renba is a roboticist mistress. He must have had a robot with him. Despite what the professor told us. Please wait here. Just don't take too long. Wait, is a hopper a teleportation device? A moment later, the robot was gone. And I was alone in the dark. Hmm. If I flew away now, I could be rid of that thing. Don't you say that! What were you up to, Renba? You didn't find robots on Mercy. What did you find? Mistress. I found something, Mistress. Is this Janiki's? The probability is high. I believe the moon below us was once a quarry. But this box is no artifact. Renba hid this box down there. It was a superb hiding place, mistress. But whether it was Renba's doing or not, I could not say. Better not have damaged it. It appears intact to me, mistress. I hope there isn't a snake in there. Oh, is that the purple robe that came with the purple gem? Why would Renba hide something like this? He must have had a reason, mistress. His choice of hiding place was extreme. Thick fabric? Janiki, what is this? It, it's probably what goes with the robe. Yeah. Oh, the brooch. It's a robe, but it's hundreds of years old. And there's something stitched along the belt. Tiny characters. Picked up in darker thread. A purple robe. So we know what Empress and Holy are. So... Is it... I? Or we? There aren't multiples. But the Empress and Holy have the symbol of the god in it. But usually it's followed by a swiggle. How about we? Now that has the buried in the middle. We pilgrims or citizens? Pilgrims. Well, there's the goddess sign. Is that to show reverence for? Pray. Followers, citizens pray, or we pilgrims pray? I think I prefer that. Let's see. Oops, no. Resume. I think that's fine. We pilgrims pray. Were you a pilgrim, Remba? Of some ancient faith, perhaps, kept secret from the pyros back on I Iox. To leave that shard for the goddess is a clue, but as an offering. 
secret from Miari herself. There's more in here. This is a brass telescope, embossed with a depiction of a tree. It's beautifully preserved. It doesn't have an inscription on the casing. Most likely, this comes from the same site as the robe. This new find should be useful in tracking down where these things were made. Oh, new site indicated, but that's not all. There's also a pen. How did Renba get his hands on all this? Asked from Silver. No inscription on the nib, but... I think this is from a different place in the telescope or the robe. In fact, I don't think we've seen anything equivalent to this pen before. So this come from a site that's entirely new to us. So are these leads, or are these things that Renba was after? Wait, mistress. I will consider the matter. Can you work out where the robe originated? I fear so. It is not a good location, mistress. But Professor Miyari was keen that we found Master Renba, and I am sure Master Renba is equally keen to be found. Is it- it's somewhere else off the rivers. I am not exactly certain, mistress, but I believe Renba traveled far from home, into the eye of the cyclones, and most likely, the winds there tore him apart. Ooh. Sight of Renba's cash. Hidden sight exists. Triangulated the moon where the purple robe originated. Found the purple robe. Found the pen. Hidden site exists somewhere in the cyclones, but I don't know where to find it yet. Okay. So, do we go there where the cyclones are? But it could have been torn apart. Now, Iox is gleaming. We could tell Miari what's up, but. This might jeopardize the people. Where next? Choose a location to plot a course. Market moon. I don't know. This is very, this is very open. Because the pen, the robe, I mean, it wants us to go to the eye of the cyclones. But isn't that where he got torn apart? There's still more I must find, and Remba's. Wait, we could search the site now. What did she say? The airless moon where Remba had his stash. Shiniki Remba found something, impossibly deep in the swirling waters of the cyclones. Is there still more to find? And is Remba's waiting for me to be found? I could go to the site to know. The thing is, I don't see a reason to go to Elbereth yet. Not today. Yeah, I wouldn't want to skip town and sell these things outside of Iox. I'll have to tell Professor Miyara that Remba's ship was most likely torn apart in the rivers, and I don't think she'll like it. Perhaps I should soften the blow. I could go there next. That's tricky. So... We can go immediately to the Cyclones and try to see if there's any remnant of Renba, or we can go back to Iox. I, I feel, oh, oh, you guys are saying that I was far away from the microphone. I'm sorry. Andra has some peculiar settings on these. So. I'm thinking that I should probably go to the Eye of the Cyclones. I don't like the idea of going back to Iox without first having proof 
that he's dead and also it could be a, a time sensitive thing where if you don't go to save him then perhaps he truly is gone or you go back to Iox and you have your things confiscated from you because well Iox doesn't want this hidden secret so I will go to the eye Ooh, it looks like it just swirls inwards, maybe? Oh, uh, let's hope we survive this one. The Cyclones. Sailing to the eye of the Cyclones. Well, I'll have to say, I'd be a little bit less keen to carry on conversations considering I have to press so many buttons to do so. Whoa! I'm not even controlling it at this point. Okay, back behind the wheel. Does the rogue's origin suggest there's a cult living inside the cyclones? Doing what? Worshipping the storm. It is possible. Humans have very strange hobbies. Or, that's probably the robot. Humans have very strange hobbies. The music is gorgeous here. Whoa, watch out for killer rocks. Wanna go to the right? Right, 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 right. We appear to be. Oh, I missed the first part of dialogue there. It's just hard to, to navigate and speak at the same time. Well, read more so. Another rapid! Ooh. Just being carried by it. Are there some calming areas? Ah. We better check the hull when next we land. We seem to have emerged close to the eye of the cyclone's mistress. Eh, I want to go up here. I cannot see which way to turn at this point, mistress. We'll have to choose one and explore. Well, this looks promising. It goes down. <gasps> What's that up ahead? It looks ominous. I see it! There's something up ahead! A moon! Can we land? There is no upriver, mistress, but there is air. We'll need to leave the ship and hop her down. Oh, okay. It is quite safe. Ooh, interesting. So they're gonna teleport there. Oh, wait. Is there saving in this game? Will Renbo be raiding for us there, in the center of the storm? The hopper fired, and for a moment I was gone. Not aboard the Nightingale, not on the moon beneath. It could have been a heartbeat or an hour. But I didn't feel the cold until I reappeared. A pile of rocks, mistress, smashed together by the waters. It seems Janiki had a taste for places- Oh, it seems Janiki had a place taste for places like this. I wonder why. Perhaps he did not like people. I hope he'll be pleased to see us. Do you think we'll find him? I prefer to believe that we will. I would like to meet him again. 
I do not remember him well, but I don't bear him any ill will. Uh, there's only an option to restart the game. There doesn't seem to be a save. Let's see where this takes us. Perhaps Renbo is waiting for us just around this corner. We can hop him back to the Nightingale and this chapter of my life will be done. Perhaps, mistress. We can only hope. Ooh. Hold it! Six. What's that? Here, in the middle of the hurricane, there was a house. It was fine. Tucked in below the overhanging rock. Wooden beams, mud brick walls, shutters. Not enough for two families to argue over. It would have been measly on Iox and grand on Elbereth. But here, it was impossible. Someone built this. Buildings do not occur naturally, mistress. How did Janiki find this? I hope we can ask him, mistress. So, are robots capable of hope? Certainly. We calculate odds, of course. But even the most unlikely outcomes must always, eventually, occur. Hope is a mathematical certainty. I like that. The mathematics does not care whether you like it or not, mistress. Hmm. Seems like a mess in there. Blocked with rubble and ruin, this whole place must be slowly peeling away from the cliff. Perhaps you might forego going inside. So, what should I do? Just go back to Iox and say, We got this far, then gave up don't think she'd send us right back here. I do not think Professor Miyari wants to make it, you sprain your ankle, mistress. I know you don't have feet, Six, but honestly, you're not as delicate as you seem to think. Or I'm not as delicate as you seem to think. Probably. I could vault over this wall here. Please, mistress. The floor beyond would only give way beneath you. And this is a bit of a drop, so do not fall, mistress. Do you see any other way in? No, neither do I. The floor looks like stone to me, Six. So it is heavy and more likely to fall. Maybe that's what happened to Renba. He fell through a hole in the floor. So, either I jump down and risk hurting myself, or jump over this and hurt myself. Here goes. The floor seems sound enough. You say just before it collapses. What did the robot go? I right onto the ruin, just now. Oh. Some kind of structure. There's a plinth inside. It looks like a shrine. It might help me date this place. Is that a lamp? It is. Someone's- The ghosts were still here. Cooking. Reading. Doing whatever ghosts do. The house was empty. But it hadn't been abandoned. Look at this place, Aaliyah. No one would live here. They, they couldn't. There's a discarded shoe. 
oddly comfortable. Whoever built this place wasn't worried about making it cozy. An inscription. And there's an inscription here. It's old, barely visible, scratched into the plaster. More words I don't know. Maybe... Hmm. Maybe I? What? Oh. Buried. It's like a protector or something. I guarded? Beloved friend. I mean, maybe that's what a bed does. I mean, that's Empress. I mean, it could be Guardian. Guardian. Uh, I think I like the eye guarded. Wait, there's that symbol. Pray. But buried. This is a symbol I've never seen before. There's the X. For buried. Could this be death? I fear death. Is that the corporeal self being buried? But there's also prayer. And the goddess, well, Empress starts with that. Huh. I fear death. The writer was dying. The angle is interesting too. Scratched by someone lying down. Yeah, so... Where did they go though? Oh, robot. Mistress. Evidently, it is good to see you intact, mistress. How did you get down from that arch? I could not climb over the wall, so I drove myself off the cliff edge. Once I had dug myself out of the sand, I found a door. And are you in one piece? Evidently, mistress. This place is empty. No ancient cults here. Oh, there's an inscription up there. Another cot. I found one just like this on the floor above. Someone grew too old or too ill to climb back up the stairs, so they made a bed down here instead. Someone died right here, mistress. So, where are the bones? A person lay on the floor here for some time after death. Renba? No. Whoever died here died scores of years ago. The lack of moisture on this moon has preserved the traces, but they are old. You're sure? The evidence is minor, but significant. The person who lay in state here was only removed recently. Are you saying Janiki took them? What remained of them? Someone did. 
Remba found a body. That's horrid. Why would he do that? I am unsure, mistress. Something must have led him to this place. There must have been something here that he needed. That's even more horrid. Yes. Yes, it is. A fire poker? A fire poker? Hmm. Stow it, maybe. We might need it. Might be worth something to someone. There's an inscription up there. More characters in an ancient script. Water goddess. Hmm. Well, that's the holy sign. So maybe she blesses? Is that like a field? Fear. Wait, why would it relate Empress with fear? Unless it wasn't fear. Why would the water goddess bless fire, though? The water goddess blesses the harvest? Does water goddess bless the harvest work? The water goddess for mercy. Is this place directly connected to mercy, then? We didn't see any shrine houses on Mercy like the one here. Not even a small one. An older custom, perhaps? Iox does not permit shrines, mistress. Iox would no doubt remove the Mercian statue. If they could work out how to shift it. Perhaps. Or perhaps even Iox does not meddle with the goddess of water when she watches over a prosperous farm. I wonder what makes farmers ship whole tree trunks out here to build a mansion in the middle of the hurricane. Oh, a heavy wooden box. This looks interesting, beautifully made. Much nicer than everything else here. I estimate it to be hollow, mistress. There's something inscribed on the lid. Might be clues to what's inside. Ooh, these are symbols I haven't seen before either, except is that last one water? Again? I'm going to have to guess the whole thing. So that's buried. Water. So I'm gonna say treasures. This word looks like less. Hid? Of? Maybe something of. We. Hmm. That doesn't seem to make sense, but holy. Of great? I mean, water is there. Force. Water is a forceful... Okay, let's see. Pressures of great force. I don't know. That doesn't seem... That seems weird. Oh. Are the lines of the great force? The blessings. But did we already have blessings? I would think that the little dash would be of, right? 
blessing. Of great value. I mean, that's what the coffer would be. But treasures of great value. I mean, of would be a tiny thing. I mean, it could be books or among other things, but treasures of great value. Let's see. Treasures of great value. Miyari would be most excited by this fine mistress, whatever proves to be inside. That sounds interesting. Hmm. I think it's a reliquary. A place to put your belongings when you die. The idea is you get them back when you return. Do people often return from death, mistress? The loop says everyone returns from death, so long as their soul gets back to the rivers. And what do you believe, mistress? Hmm. Nobody knows the history of the nebula. If everyone who dies comes back, then why don't they know? Perhaps you require more evidence. So I can lift the lid myself, or he can open it. It might be trapped. Shall we open the box, mistress? So long as Janiki's not in it. Dr. Remba would not fit in such a small box. Perhaps it is just his head. <laughs> oh no, the last option. We can take that back to Miari. No. No, please. Six, please. Apologies, mistress. Perhaps it contains his foot. Ah, oh, six. That's even worse. Open it up, six. If there's a head in there, I don't want to see it. Not locked, mistress, but stiff. And I lack fingers for leverage. Okay. Try it myself. Move over. I hope this doesn't result in a trap. Let's see if I can shift it. Curses. I've got fingers, but I can't get them under the lid. Oh, yeah. There's the iron poker, right? I might be able to snap the lock. Mistress, is it moving? It's definitely shifting. Here it goes, then. Oh, is that a... <gasps> That's a crown! Is that THE crown? 